Targum Neufiti, Genesis 117. Vishavi Yatahon Aikari de Adonai, Birkiya Shemaya, Lamanhara al Ara. And we go back to the beginning. This is conjunction and the Sheen Vav Yod verbal root. It is the Pa'el perfect third person masculine singular. And we know it's Pa'el not because there is a Pa'al in Targum Neofiti, but we see an onkelos, an opposition and meaning between Pa'al and Pa'el, and this suits that. This is he put or placed, kind of like the same verbal root in Hebrew. Here we have the sign of the direct object and third person masculine plural suffix. He put them. And then next is not a construct, but words that go together. It's not a construct because we have the relative. The glory of Adonai. And then this next one is a construct in the expanse of the heavens. And then we have Lamed, Mem, and then that Aleph suffix. This is an Afel infinitive. It's to give light upon the earth. So altogether, the glory of Adonai put them in the expanse of the heavens to give light upon the earth. Now, I want to comment right now on the glory of Adonai. This is the first time we've seen something other than the Memra of Adonai, the word of Adonai, acting. We're going to see the glory of Adonai show up again starting in Genesis 128. But it is interesting that it's not Memra here, where, of course, in Ankalos, it is only Adonai.